Hi guys, it's Friday. Point number one, I have been messing around with the lighting for a while and I'm in a different location so that I get the lighting from outside plus this one light coming down because this other light's broken and it's buzzing and what can you do? Second thing, there is an animal on the roof somewhere and it keeps running around making noises and I don't know what it is or why. So if you hear it, I don't know. If, if you hear it, sorry. It's just there's an animal. I don't know what to do about it. But third thing is that I've tried to make this video like six times and I keep saying weird stuff that doesn't make sense and we're gonna try it again this time and hope for the best. You know how sometimes you'll be thinking about a conversation that you had with somebody and then that same person will bring it up like five minutes later like remember that time we had that conversation and you're like what I was just thinking about that or when you um, hear your phone ring and you like predict who it's gonna be and then you answer it and that's assuming you like don't have caller ID which everyone does but when you like hear it from across the room and you're like oh I bet it's blah blah, blah and then it is or when you're sitting in class and your professor is speaking and you like know that they're gonna call on you like you just feel it in your heart and then they call on you why does that happen and why does it happen to me so often is that yesterday at dinner um, we were eating popsicles for dessert and one of my friends was eating blue raspberry flavored popsicle and all of a sudden I was just overcome with this like anger about blue raspberry and the fact that it doesn't exist and why is it a flavor and why do people like it because I can't stand it and I don't understand the point I don't understand anything about it I went on this rant for like 15 minutes and everyone was just like all right you know fine blue raspberry whatever it's fine I went back to my room later that night to find that Christina Horner made a video about blue raspberry like a few days ago that I hadn't even hadn't checked YouTube in a while hadn't seen it and I watched it and I was like this is weird because I was just talking about it um and also I'm in a class that requires us to turn in these discussion questions every day. So when there's a lull in the conversation, my professor will be like, oh, I'm just gonna sift through these papers and choose one at random. It's always mine, and I always know exactly when it's going to be mine. But you can get this feeling, and you know, and then I'll be on Facebook sometimes, and I can predict exactly who's gonna message me at what time, and I just get this feeling, and then it happens, and it's just like, it's almost not weird anymore, except that it is weird, and I don't understand how these things happen. Do they happen to you? How often? And do you think it's weird? Because I do. So yeah, psychic moments. I don't mean communicating with the dead or like seeing apparitions. I just mean like, you know, having a conversation about blue raspberries and then going on YouTube and watching someone else struggle with a blue raspberry conundrum as well. It's a weird world. Anyway, I hope you guys all had great Valentine's Days. Um, I don't know if that's even like a thing. Do people have like great Valentine's Days? I don't know. But I would like to bring up that Valentine's Day is a great day because you can get bags full of only red cookie pops. They're all just red. They're all like the cherry kind and you don't have to worry about the orange ones or the brown ones and the blue ones which I don't even like. I only like red and now I got a whole bag of red ones for like half off and Valentine's Day should be every day. Sophie, I will see you on Tuesday. I don't know what this video was.